The humble pig may provide hope for 30 million diabetes sufferers around the world. More than a dozen patients have taken part in a scientific trial of pig cell transplants, and two of them have been able to stop using insulin altogether. Bridget Glanville reports from Auckland. These pigs are the cleanest in the world. They need to be as their pancreas cells are being transplanted into people suffering from diabetes. Results from human trials in New Zealand and Moscow show pig cells mimic the body's natural production of insulin. It was surprising that we were using the lowest dose at the beginning and we thought this might occur in the later doses, but to see two of eight patients going off insulin at the lower dose was a surprise, a wonderful surprise. Michael Hellier received a low-dose transplant in the pilot program. His cells lasted nine years and he was able to reduce his insulin intake by 30%. Now what that means is that your chances of having a, a terrible low, low blood sugar episode are much diminished. 30 million people around the world have diabetes, more than 100,000 of them in Australia. Researchers say this is a potential cure. But there have been fears this would create more problems than it set out to cure. We were always concerned that HIV-like viruses that, uh, that animals have uh, may be transferred into the humans receiving the transplanted tissue. The safety concerns were so great, Australian authorities placed a five-year ban on pig cell transplants. But late last year, with the approval of the World Health Organisation, the ban was lifted, opening the door to trials in Australia. It could be scaled up to be at a cost-effective treatment for millions and millions of people. Researchers hope human trials will start in Australia by the end of the year. Bridget Glanville, ABC News, Auckland.